All right, guys, I'm wondering how Kim K is doing. She's losing weight and looking great, but I mean, I haven't heard from the Kardashians in like forever. It's crazy. Like, they were like so famous, right? Now, you know, I'm not sure what's going on with them, if they're dealing with any like financial, they're not dealing with financial problems, but maybe their, their, their jobs are taken down or no one's going to hire them or whatever, which is terrible. But I mean, if they did what they did, they deserve it, right? I mean, you know, if they're going to say and do the things that they said and did, then, you know, it's terrible. I personally think that, and who am I to judge? Normally, I love Kim Kardashian and their family. I think they're amazing. But I think, you know, if they did do something, they deserve punishment, severe punishment for this, if it's as bad as this is. But a lot of times, people that are involved with the clothing line, just like the money, they like the pay, they like the look of the clothes. You know, if Balenciaga is the only one that's involved with the, um, with the uh, scandal, then Balenciaga is the only one involved, right? Maybe Kim K just was in getting contracts and looking beautiful at the clothes, but Balenciaga was the one that did that campaign, right? So we can't accuse the Kardashians of doing something if they didn't. Now, they worked very closely with them, and it's possible they did, and it seems to me like the Kardashians are getting in serious trouble, and they're getting a lot of negative comments. Now, we don't know who's to blame. We know this Volta girl from Balenciaga is definitely to blame, um, but the people that allowed that campaign to go on, I mean, you know, and you know, there's some people that might have been like, oh, whatever, it's a, it's a Balenciaga campaign, go ahead, do it. They might not have even looked at it and thought, it's Balenciaga, they're going to do well, go ahead, right? But I'm saying someone that actually saw the campaign and knew that it had to do with harming children and all that, if they saw the campaign and knew that, then they would be like, of, of course they'd be at fault, right? And they'd be someone that would, that deserved to get in trouble. Now, in terms of like a fashion line, you know, a lot of people are very much like, if you're, if you're into fashion, you like beautiful fashion. I mean, if I shop somewhere and they did something horrendous, I, I wouldn't be involved in it because I like the clothes. I think they're gorgeous clothes and that's why I bought them. And I had no idea they were going to be involved in something horrendous, you know. And to be able to say, you know, toss the clothes or get rid of the clothes, well, what are you going to do with the clothes, right? Talk, I mean, I mean, you know, I mean, if you, and the thing is, obviously they did something horrible, right? So it's understandable if you're going to be like, I'm not going to believe in this brand at all. I'm just going to ban it from existence and toss them out. That would be understandable, you know, it would be understandable. But the reason why you bought the clothes in the first place is because they're gorgeous clothes, right? You're not going to be like, Oh, well, you know, I, and, and a lot of people that buy from name brands, they're not all about whatever the name brand is about, right? You know, I like to wear clothes from, from wherever I buy clothes. I like to wear wigs from wherever I buy wigs. I like to wear stilettos where I buy stilettos and makeup where I buy makeup. I don't, I shouldn't feel responsible for the, the, the horrendous things that maybe the, the clothing line does. If I don't do those things or I'm not involved in things like that, right? So Kim Kardashian, I mean, maybe she didn't do anything. I mean, it's possible she wasn't involved in the scandal. It's possible um, that she didn't approve those layouts for the for the for the um, for the new campaign, right? It's possible. So how can we blame her, right? But, I mean, if she was involved, it's terrible, and no one should live like that and be like that, and she could be in serious trouble. Now, I saw a video on Kim Kardashian and her family, and they looked amazingly. It was, like, really, really good. I was like, oh, my God. So maybe they found this situation and realized, hey, we, we just bought the clothes because they were nice. They paid us because we were campaigning for them. And we were in their campaigns, so it wasn't our fault. So maybe they're going to have a huge comeback. I don't know. Anyway, maybe they will, right? Hopefully they will, because I do like Kim Kardashian. I do like, 
um, Khloe Kardashian. I love Khloe Kardashian. I love Kendall Jenner very much. I love Kylie Jenner. You know, even though they're all plastic and do do kind of all crazy things, but I like them very much because not all of them are plastic, but I like them. I don't think Kendall Jenner does plastic surgery, but anyway, maybe she does Botox. But I like them and everything. But if they did what they what is apparently what we think they did, it's horrible. But in general, you know, like I said, if you buy a clothing line. Are you responsible for everything the clothing line does? No, right? Unless you specifically were responsible. In that case, you should be punished. Anyway, bye now. Thank you. Bye, darlings.